Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to analyze the questions about structure analysis. The question will be analyzed due to slope deflection method. So let's solve the question. First, I'm going to specify the fixed end moment. There's just one fixed end moment from B to A. WL squared over 8 will be equal to 12 multiplied with 8 squared over 8, 96 kilo Newton meter. Okay, and now moment, moment from D to B is equal to zero because it is pin connection. Uh, and I'm going to use the modified formula to determine the moment from B to D. 3i over 6 multiplied with theta B minus delta over L and plus zero moment from b to c equal to 3i over 6 multiplied with theta b minus delta over l sorry if it ends with pin or roller you can use the modified formula. Now I use the modified, form modified formula, so I don't need to uh, calculate uh, theta c or uh, theta d. And we have a fixed end moment 96. Uh, this will be equal to moment CB and equal to moment AB. So now, you know, the, the moments at the same supports, the summation of them must be equal to zero. And this three moment and the summation of this three moment must be equal to zero. Let's write them. This moment BD plus moment BC plus moment BA, right? Will be equal to zero. And this is going to be 3EI theta B over 6 and plus 3EI theta B over 6 and plus. 3EI theta b over 8 plus 96 equal to 0. And from this equation, I am going to obtain theta b s minus 768 over 11 EI. Now I obtain my theta b. So if I uh, know the theta b, I'm going to write this own place. I'm going to obtain the moments. So let's write it. Moment BD will be equal to minus, sorry, minus 34.9 kilo Newton meter. And the moment BC will be equal to minus 34.9 kilo Newton meter. And moment BA will be equal to uh, 69.82 kilo Newton meter. Okay. Now I have my moments. If I have moments, let's uh, find the shear forces. I have moments. It's time for shear forces. So the first part, first one will be uh, D to B. Okay, yes. This is D, this is B, I have a B here, I have a D here, and uh, I have a moment at this direction. Sorry, no, it's not at this direction. Let's check the question. Minus 34.9, so it will be at this direction, actually. So total moment at 
d is equal to 0 and this direction is positive 34.9 plus vb multiplied with 6 equal to 0 and vb is equal to minus 5.82 kilonewtons. Okay, and the, the total Fy is equal to zero. There is no any vertical forces, so we are going to write like that. Plus Vd equal to zero and Vd minus 5.82. Sorry, positive. When I take this to the other side, positive kilonewton. Okay, so now let's uh, find for the second part. Uh, this will be B. This will be C. I have a moment at this direction. 34.9. Okay. And total moment at B is equal to 0. And this direction is positive. I have a shear like that and a shear like that. So I'm going to write, write the equation. 34.9 plus Vc multiplied with 6 equal to 0. So Vc will be equal to minus 5.82 kilonewton. And total Fy is equal to 0. From this I'm going to obtain uh, minus 5.82 plus Vb equal to 0 and uh, will be will be 1.82 kilo nift and let's write for the last part and then we're going to draw the shear and the moment diagrams for the last part it will be a and this will be b and i have a moment 69.82 and I have a, a distributed load as you can see 12 kN when I multiply it with 8 it will be 96 as a point load and it will uh, act at the mid of the beam sorry the column 96 and I have a shear here I have a shear here total moment at a is equal to zero now so that will be minus 96 multiplied with 4 because this is 4 and this is 4 meter and uh, plus now this will also be negative minus 69.82 and plus bb multiplied with 8 vb will be equal to 56.7 kilo newton and uh, total fy is equal to 0 we have 96 minus 56.7 and also minus VA equal to zero and VA will be equal to 39.3 kilonewt. Now I find all my shears. So uh, let's find the shear and the moment diagrams. So now for uh, D to B, this is D and this is b and at the d i have a shear as 5.82 as positive 5.82 as positive now you can see here i'm gonna i'm gonna raise with 5.82 i will go on with the same amount and i'm going to decrease with 5.82 because it's a down direction at b 
and let's draw for the next part from B to C at B I have a, a 5.82 as positive and I will continue with the same amount and I'm going to decrease at the 5.82 because at C it is down right, downward direction let's draw for the next part and this is going to be the last part for us sorry I have a, a shear as 39.3 39.3 and I have a 96 as a distributed load and it's going to decrease as distributed load it's going to reach this point 56.7 and this x value I'm going to need it so x over 8 minus x will be equal to 39.3 over 56.7 and x will be equal to 3.27 so now let's draw the moment diagrams for the O I'm going to start with the first one and uh, this is D, this is B now you can see this is pin connection in the, in the question that was a pin connection for this so I'm going to uh, start with uh, zero and I'm going to increase at this amount of area okay when I increase at this amount of area this is six meter this is also six meter when I am eight point uh, sorry five point eighty two multiplied with eight uh, with six I'm going to reach thirty four point nine And for this one, I am going to have a moment. Uh, normally, I have a moment as here, thirty-four point nine, right? And I'm going to increase at this amount of area, five point eighty-two multiplied with six, and I'm going to reach this point. This is B. This is C. And for this, the last part, uh, this is also B, this is A, okay, no, 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 sorry, this is A, this is B, I confused, this is A and this is B, at A, I, I don't have any moment, so I'm going to increase at this amount of area from zero. This amount of area is, will be calculated 39, 39.3 uh, multiplied 3.27 uh, when I uh, divide over two, and I'm going to obtain this amount, and I'm going to increase at this amount, and I increase and I reach this 64.3, and then I'm going to decrease at this amount. So that will be equal to 69.82 kilo. Yeah, no, sorry, sorry, I don't need to write this one. These are the moment diagrams, these are the shear diagrams. Thank you for watching me. The question is that. If you like and if you want to see the more of the videos, please subscribe and share with your friends. If I did anything wrong, please comment and I'm going to revise and uh, try to uh, fix it. Thank you for watching. See you for the next question.